And then Molt Bosses though. Yeah, I feel like this is the kind of game that should get harder the further you get into the fight. It's the difference between having lives and no lives. In one with the guy games, you generally want to put the interesting but easier phases last on bosses. As in for Solgrin, for example, it might want to be the boss shit. That's a perfect design in my opinion. The first phase is learning pattern, which you don't want to do at the very end of a boss. The second phase is tricky execution, which, well, again, you don't necessarily want to do at the end of the boss. The third phase, again, is stuff you can figure out by dying to it once, each attack it or immediately get it. At the last phase you can get without having seen it once before. But that's really good. That's a nice position for him to be in. Pretty easy to dock. There, well, not there, but before. That's tricky. I should have used the ball. So let's do this. I understand this attack now. I simply need to dodge the bubbles and then focus on the walls. Too bad this face. Actually, it's kind of kind of start to like. It. There we go. was a mistake. Okay, thank you. That was an excellent spawn there. I didn't have another dash. I should have seen that one coming. Oh well, what's the case? I guess I could technically get hit all the way to the end and still make it. Goodbye. Oh, Walter. I like this boss.
Once you understand the pattern in the end rage, you'll like it.